Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Stefan and this is the French Cooking Academy on location filming from France. Now, you have been many asking me how the French people make their food, what kind of things they prepare on the everyday basis. Now, my aunt likes to make treats. Last time she showed us how to make a very simple biscuit and called the palmier. And today, she's back again. She took out this very rustic looking cookbook, as you can see on the screen. Uh, and she's gonna make something called the roulé à la confiture. Now, in English, as the roulade, I think, which is a sponge cake layered with jam. And then we're gonna roll it up and slice it as an easy treat. She claims it's only 15 minutes to make and even children can make it with the parents. So let's have a look how it's made. So my aunt strikes again with another simple recipe and today she's going to show us how to make a very, very simple uh, roulé uh, à la confiture de framboise, uh, which is basically like a rolled sponge cake with jam. So she's going to start here with the two balls. It's the first step to separate uh, the eggs from the white and the egg yolks. This is the first step of the recipe. Okay, so very easy to do that with the shells. All done. The next step consists of putting 80 grams of white sugar in your egg yolks and mix them well so that they become white, so you whiten the eggs. When this is done, the next step is to put 40 grams of cornstarch. Then you mix the whole lot, mix with the eggs, and you get a nice compound. As soon as the egg yolks are done, you're going to move on to the egg white and you're going to whisk them with a little bit of salt until they become a meringue, basically. So you can use a hand mixer or electric mixer. That should do it. So you get some nice and firm egg white. Now we're ready to pour the meringue into the egg yolks that we had with the starch. So you take all of the meringue pour it over the eggs and then slowly mix it. We're using a, a whisk here. So you can do this in two times. Start with a bit of the meringue or half of it and wait until it incorporates and then there goes the rest. All right, nice and smooth. It's all ready to be poured in. So when I say poured in, basically we need to take the mix and pour it onto a baking tray and lay it totally flat so that we can cook it to make that sponge cake base. Once it's in, it's a bit rough, so you can use a spatula like that and even out all of the, uh, the dough here or the mixture to make sure it's laid at the same level everywhere. So as soon as the uh, mixture is laid out like that, uh, there's no need to rest. You can put it straight into the oven in a preheated oven at 215-220 degrees Celsius. It's in the oven. Cooking time will be 10 minutes. And while your sponge cake base is cooking, uh, you take a, a sheet of uh, baking paper and we're going to sprinkle some flour uh, to prepare. Because when you're going to take the um, sponge cake out of the oven, we're going to turn it upside down on the flour and just to avoid sticking. As soon as the <coughs> sponge cake is done, we're going to have to turn it upside down on the flour. And bit by bit, try to remove the baking paper that was at the bottom. And immediately after, as it's warm, <laughs> sorry for the commenting, you put the jam. So we're using raspberry jam. So this is done on the, on the hot sponge cake. So you make sure you get a nice layer, not too thick. Uh, otherwise it's gonna be a bit overpowering and when you eat it, you want a light coating. Next, you're gonna immediately roll the whole lot when it's hot with the jam to make the roll. And that's it, the roulet is ready. So now you can move it to uh, another tray. So we've got this uh, glass tray on the back here. And finally, we're coating the whole lot with icing sugar. All right, so this is the uh, finished raw product. Uh, cut it with sugar and we have to leave it to rest and cool down before we can do the rest, which is just slicing it up and see how it's gonna look like. So we're gonna cut this size to make it nice and neat, but that's gonna happen in within 30 minutes time. 30 minutes have passed and now we're ready to cut open our roulé. So we're just gonna cut the end bit first, huh? it's a bit untidy, to reveal, ooh, look at that, yes. This is Federalite. It's fluffy, 
it's very easy to eat and it's just enough jam that makes it very easy as well as recipe for kids. If you have kids at home, it's an extremely simple recipe and it is addictive. Yum. Wow, and I have to say that this was super easy, just looking at it, and it was super beautiful to eat as well. It tastes absolutely uh, delicious, that, that jam in there, and the, the softness, and even the next day, that thing really stays really, really soft. So that complete the video for the day, guys. I hope you enjoy it, and if you want to make that recipe, don't hesitate. As always, any questions or comments, drop this in the comment section, and stay tuned on the French Cooking Academy for more to come. See you.